Today, we're looking at how babies grow. Right, here you go, Chris. You can get a nice close look at my belly button with that. Whoa, I think I've missed something. Why on earth would I, or anyone, want to look at your belly button? Well, I thought we were looking at how babies grow. Yes, but what's that got to do with your... Ah, hold on. I see where you're going with this. Exactly. Because did you know that your belly button used to be your mouth and your bum? OK, yes, that's true. But we still don't need to look at your belly buttons, aren't? Because I've got something much more impressive. Take a look at this. Whoa! That is much more impressive than my belly button because this is a real human placenta and umbilical cord. These amazing organs are what keep a baby alive and able to grow inside its mum. The placenta's job is to absorb oxygen and vital nutrients from the mum's blood and deliver them to the baby via the umbilical cord. As well as this, the umbilical cord also carries waste products, that's wee poo and carbon dioxide, away from the baby, down the umbilical cord and through the placenta into mum's body for her to get rid of. Now, once you're born, you don't need these anymore, which is why we have these to show you. They've been kindly donated to us by a mum who's given birth to her baby and she's happy for us to show them to you, which is pretty special. This placenta is absolutely amazing. But, you know, I've always said that there's really only one thing better than a real human placenta, and that is a double human placenta from twins. Wow! This must have been what our placenta looked like when we were inside our mum. Absolutely. This has also kindly been donated by the mum of twins. So what you can see here is two placentas and two umbilical cords. After you're born, so the cord gets snipped off, leaving you with your belly button. But until then, this cord is your lifeline. But what does a baby look like when it's actually inside its mum? We're going to show you. Now, what we've got here is a real live baby. Zon, this isn't a baby, this is Amelia, and she's a grown-up. That's true. Thanks very much for coming into the lab, Amelia. Thanks, but Amelia. But actually, inside Amelia is a real live baby. Oh. And ordinarily, of course, we couldn't show you that baby, but we have this ultrasound scanner. So, Amelia, are you having a boy or a girl? A boy. A boy. Amelia, how many weeks pregnant are you? 29 weeks. At this stage, a baby's organs are developed. Just here, what you can see beating is Amelia's baby's heart. Wow, amazing! The white things here are his bones, so that's his backbone. Very clearly, you can see that there. Surrounding the baby, these big black patches are liquid. And that's because the baby's sitting in a thing called the amniotic sac. So it's sitting in a big sac full of fluid. That protects it from bumps and from infections. At the moment, his eyes have started to work, his heart and all his organs are working normally. The one massive difference between being inside Amelia and being out in the world is that this little boy is breathing entirely through his umbilical cord, through his belly button. But what we really want to know is what does he look like? So we've been able to do a 4D scan. 4D scans provide an incredible lifelike image of the baby inside the womb. You can see his eyes, his nose and his little mouth. Amelia, what do you think? It's amazing. He looks like his dad, but with my nose. <sighs> And there's another really nice thing here. He has found another use for his placenta, because as well as giving him all his oxygen and nutrients, he's also been using it as a pillow. So I think you've got a very resourceful young man in there. Amelia, thank you so much for letting us meet him. Thanks very much. No problem.